So I'm at this usual partner, 2018. Um, customer complaint is the engine is not starting. And you can see here, when you turn the key, there isn't any engine management light and you've got your, uh, your padlock on, which basically means that it's immobilised. So I've already checked out with the scan tool and there isn't any communication with the engine ECU. So first check is for power. So we'll check for power and see if there's any present. So I'm back probed in at the engine ECU and you can see I'm back probed into the two thick power wires. Um, the test light is not lit up. Um, so we'll look at our wiring diagram and try and suss this one out. So looking at the wiring diagram, I've actually pulled up. Uh, so that's K79, that's the ignition really. Um, so F94, which is that 20 amp fuse, that runs down and that feeds those two pins, so those two red wires. Um, so at that relay, we should have a trigger which comes from pin 29 and runs down into pin 57 of the engine ECU. Have we got a, a signal or an earth getting switched to that relay from the engine ECU? Uh, and we'll check it up at the engine ECU to confirm. What I'll do is I'll switch the ignition on. If you come round here, uh, I've got my test lamp. So we can see that the wire that we're looking for is that grey with a red tracer. Um, and I've already gave that a wee pinch on my probe. So what will do it. We'll set that. We'll set that on that wire there, and we'll connect our test light to battery positive. You can see the test light lights up. So we have got a switch earth coming out of that ECU for that relay, but. If we check it at the relay itself, you can see we've got nothing. So we've got an open circuit and this wiring one down here somewhere. Now I've stuck the engine fuse box in that out. And I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Look, right in there. So I've repaired that wire that you've seen, um, so now when I put this test lamp uh, on that pin and I, I've got it on the battery positive, as you can see there, so once I switch that ignition on, if that test lamp lights up, then we know that that relay is going to switch. So if I turn the ignition on, Have a look at that test lamp, you can see it lights up. So that's a problem fixed. Let's see if it starts. But hey, fault fixed. So it was a broken wire for the switching side of the ignition relay. And um, that's the issue. That wire is a grey and red tracer. Just goes to show a nice 2018 plate. How many miles has it got on it? under 10,000 miles and it's getting wiring issues already see you on the next one